If you could go back in time, back to the 1920s, to the golden age of magic, and watch the great Howard Thurston perform, you might spot it. An ornate wooden box, a special box, a box that held secrets. Thurston would show it empty, then pull silk after silk from it. It was part of his wonder show of the universe. My wife and I own that box now. It's in our collection of magic memorabilia. We also have a portrait of Thurston. It was taken in 1924. Thurston walked into a photographer's studio carrying the box and a deck of cards. As the photographer set up to take his portrait, Thurston carefully studied the deck. After changing his mind a few times, he settled on the Queen of Clubs. Who knows why we choose the cards we do? When Thurston was set, the photographer clicked the shutter. The picture was made. An instant in time was frozen forever. My wife and I perform magic as Murloc and Ebor. As an honor to Thurston, we created a trick using his picture. We include his box and an old camera to help set the mood. After telling the story of the photograph, we ask someone to pick a card, any card. They do. It's always the Four of Spades. Who knows why we choose the cards we do? We invite the person, in fact the whole audience, to try to change the past. We tell them to think back, back almost a century, to that day in the photographer's studio, back to that moment when Thurston selected the Queen of Clubs. Think hard and maybe they can change Thurston's mind. Make him pick the Four of Spades instead, the card they picked. We click the shutter of the old camera. If they succeeded, if Thurston's choice of card changed, then reality changed and the picture should too. When we look at the portrait again, sure enough, Thurston is holding the Four of Spades. The trick was a crowd pleaser, one we repeated time after time in our own version of the wonder show of the universe. One night, something very strange happened. When we revealed the portrait at the end, Thurston was not holding the Four of Spades. He was holding the Ace of Hearts. We were both shocked and mystified. It's a strange thing when a trick fools the magician doing it, when the creators of surprise are themselves surprised. After the show, my wife noticed a small piece of folded paper inside Thurston's magic box. Had we overlooked something that had been in the box all along? It didn't seem possible. We had used that box for years and knew its secrets. Or did we? She unfolded the paper slowly. It read, Murloc and Ebor, I like your trick very much. But if I were going to change my mind and pick another card for the photograph, I would have chosen the Ace of Hearts. What do you think? Yours, Howard Thurston. For years, we had been doing a trick that tried to change Thurston's mind. But now, it seemed he was trying to change ours. A while after that strange night, we put a note of our own in the box. When we checked later, it was gone. We don't know for sure if he ever got our message. Perhaps it takes some time to travel back all those years. We look at those old pictures of Thurston performing a little differently now. We know that when we see the box, it has its secrets. And we hope that some night, 
Thurston will find a small piece of paper inside that box of mystery. He'll read our note, a message from his future, an answer to our past. We can imagine him sitting down to write us again. We don't know if he will, or what he'll say. Only time will tell.